16 years ago today, on a quiet stretch of Racine County farmland, a young woman was found murdered. Badly beaten and abused uh, and literally thrown out like trash in our county. This is the best guess of what the 18 to 25 year old looked like in 1999, wearing a distinctive denim shirt with red flowers on it. Still no one knows who she was or where she came from. Her body was recently exhumed to use new technology to look for clues. And on this day, she was reburied. Our sister, child of God, and we commit her to her resting place. Jane Doe's murder is personal for cold case investigator Tracy Hintz. I mean, this has become almost a life work for you. I, and, and it will continue until I identify her and bring those responsible to answer for their crime. I struggled with making the decision to ultimately do this because it wasn't it was an easy thing to do because I, I just didn't want to disturb her. But eventually, this will this is all going to pan out and it won't be for naught. The headstone here will be put back in place. It reads, gone but not forgotten. And the sheriff says he hopes to be able to give her a new headstone, one with her actual name. I'm embarrassed to say that we still have to refer to her as Jane Doe. I desperately, we desperately want to put a name with this individual. I have no doubt that there is a, a mother missing their daughter, a father missing a daughter, a sister. She, somebody knows her. Identifying the young woman would be a big step in finding her killer. In Caledonia, Nick Bohr, WISN 12 News. The sheriff says investigators did gather new evidence from the exhumation, but they're not comfortable talking about their new leads. Anyone who thinks they can help identify the young woman is asked to call the Racine County Sheriff's Office at 262-636-3190. And callers can remain anonymous.